Well, my main goal here is to reach as many families as possible. Christmas is coming early for some parents at PS85 who may be at the end of their rope when it comes to accessing resources for themselves or their children. This new Watson app created by the student tech wizards from Fordham was unveiled at the university and its main feature, it can link them directly to social and health services right in their neighborhood. Everything in the app is in, within their area code. So whether I'm sending them to a shelter, a food pantry, a clinic, everything that I will be able to provide them with is arm's distance from their house and walking distance. With just a click, the app can tell you the point person at an agency or organization, the best after school program located right around the corner, and housing too. All information Anna Pulakis and her team work months to provide. People can access this now the way it's designed because you need a username and password so it's still in the processing phase I would say but we're hoping that it would become an app and then parents would be able or anyone would be able to put it on their iPhone and use it like a regular app, type in the question and then hopefully the document as we showed earlier would come up with the information they want. Also mixing technology with compassion, Ruin and Chin, a graduate student majoring in business analytics in Alon Yoeli, a junior majoring in mathematics, computer science, and Italian studies. As somebody from California, I, I actually had no idea how uh, it was for students, so uh, for young students in the Bronx, so it's, it was definitely interesting. If they just Google for this uh, information, sometimes they, they may have some very, the results may be very frustrating and uh, uh, what we are doing here is just like uh, simplify this process and make the results really satisfying for them. And on the receiving end is a very pleased principal of PS85 who saw tremendous opportunity in signing up for the pilot program. I think this is an amazing example of how institutions of higher learning can connect with community schools to serve the population. And, and to provide resources and experiences for not just students that are attending school, but also for the people in the community. The benefits are also for the students at Fordham. Dr. Frank Chu, director of the Laboratory of Informatics and Data Mining, guided the students on the app. So we have students, our team, come from different backgrounds, from computer science, mathematics, from business school. Together, you know, we can get to some of the very very good project. Yeah. Also guiding the project meant to strengthen the educational success of kids, it's Dr. Anita Vasquez Batisti, Associate Dean of the Graduate School of Education. We've always been very strong with the academic approach, but now it's more, it's social services, it's mental health, and we're dealing with the whole child, the whole family, the entire community. <laughs> it's been um, from the beginning uh, when we started out just as a small seed to see now that we planted it, it's grown into such a beautiful project. Uh, to be able to assist our families in the community at PS85. Take a look right here. This is the home page for PS85. If all goes as planned, parents will soon have a whole list of resources available from child rearing and more. The program is getting high marks right here, but the true test will be with the parents. For BronxNet, this is Arlene Makoko.